All right, what's up? What's going on? We got a greasy run today, you know. Um, during the whole thing, I'm gonna be just overall talking about greasy and how I think to win a greasy run. Not completely sure. What are our our tasks again for today? Um, there is a chance I don't win this run. But, even if not, you know, it is what it is. Uh, as long as I get at least one of those two challenges complete, the 80% um, eighty percent, whatever they were called, man. I forget completely. 80% unholy crit chance, that's what it was. Or the 150%, uh, sorry, 200% spawn rate. Off rip, we can get rid of this and this. So what, what do you do? Okay, well that's good for me at least. Can I sell those. And before we play, we're buy those. See what's in the shop. It's not worth it. None of it. Mm, none of it. None of it. How do you say none of it? None, zero, zilch, nada. Mm, okay, there we go, there's something, see. Uh, so basically, Golden Fist is a like, very, what I feel is prominent thing in this. Swift Vengeance, we'll play this like once or twice, maybe. This whole entire time. And then we're gonna be done with it, so. There's that. Like, Swift Vengeance is really one of those things you don't need. Um, if you're trying to do a Greasy Run, it is best to have almost, like, all cards unlocked. As you can see, I'm missing, like, two or three card unlocks. Uh, temptation. Yeah, sure, temptation will work. Could use a charge up. Every time a card is banished, yeah, sure. And then, plus 10. And then do I gain an extra? I don't think I do. Holy crit, yeah. Come on, give me... No. It's not what we're here for. I did want to go slash for this run, so I'm probably going to buy the slasher. Um. Just because the slasher is like... A bit of a necessity. Just a tiny bit. What? Increase damage, increase spawn rate. Probably gonna go for the spawn rate first. Replenish, I'm sorry. You gotta go, or maybe not. Fat Rock can go. We'll play Replenish, actually. Um, a Judgment. And then... Sell the Judgment. And then... Still don't have enough money, but that's alright. We will next turn. Next turn, there will hopefully be a lot of enemies to hit the, uh... I forget what it's called. Not this. I was hoping for Golden Fist. Unfortunate as it may be. Bizarre gives you plus 25. That's pretty good. Um, whoa. Whoa. Don't know what's going on right now. 
not incredibly sure. Okay, there we go. Sorry, my computer was like lagging out like crazy and I'm not sure why. Slasher, Swift Vengeance, um, they don't want Slasher. Much rather have, like, High Roller. Blessing, that is pretty good. Oh, I should have played my two Temptations or at least one of them before I bought Slasher. Blessing is pretty good, but I have a feeling we'll see it again. Also, we just kind of need the high roller. Dude, what is going on? Like, my computer is lagging kind of hard for no reason. Reshuffle me again. <laughs> reshuffle me. Well, I'll reshuffle until I'm broke. I don't care. We are here for luck we're here for high roller or another unholy crit that works temptation unholy crit as much as i'd love to play two temptations in one turn um just getting the so does the unholy pulse like critical has charges oh so it goes it it goes down instead of charging up it charges down and it just does like a giant wave attack to everybody okay i like that it's interesting interesting for sure good sell good sell And then, yeah, I can play my blue slasher. You don't have really a purpose. Like, I've already played one of those, haven't I? Yeah. And let me just see. Plus shift to hang on. What? Why are you plus 15? And you're only plus... Hang on. Oh. Oh, that's pretty good. It's pretty good. Yeah, um, I was saying, for this you want to have a lot of cards unlocked. Because if you're like, you know, I don't know how far through the game, but you're not far enough through the game, unlocking cards is... If you don't have enough cards unlocked, you're not going to have like access to some of these things. For example, I know my first time doing a Greasy run, uh, I didn't, I had Temptation unlocked, I didn't have Recycle, I didn't have, um, didn't have Recycle, I didn't have Jackpot, I didn't have Insurance, didn't have Replenish, didn't have Offering of Flesh, Slasher, bro, that's embarrassing. Dude, stop didn't have like any of this man so there's a lot of stuff that I didn't have when I uh, first tried to do a greasy run I think our slashers are gonna work pretty well with this unholy pulse tower let's get course uh, we do have the slashers coming up, so... Golden Fist. I see, there's that giant lag spike again. I think it's just the coins. I think the coins are, like, lagging out the game. Or maybe not. Maybe it's... I, I couldn't tell you what it is, I mean, honest. Recycle... We don't want to play Guns of God because we're going to get the slasher coming up soon. What we do want is a punish. Let's 
Actually, free gravitational pull will work. One hundred and thirteen. Now what we want to do is get high roller. Now what we want to do is get high roller. Please. I beg of you, my good sir, just give me high roller. I don't see what the issue is. And then, uh, gravitational pull, it's gonna summon a little circle somewhere that'll pull enemies into the center. It's actually pretty nice. Um, we are running a little bit low on defenses and whatnot, thankfully. Hang on, plus 20. Oh, I can't sell you, but I can sell you. And I can sell you. Because we, we are quite literally just looking for unholy crits like that. That's perfect. And a purple and whole uh, guns of God is pretty good too. So hopefully the slashers can do some work. Um, we'll work on damage during the hopefully gluttony phase if we get to it. Increases reach rate of all active. No, we want cells, good cells, high cells. Like insurance, unholy crit, then 35, 35, does that give us the 100? Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Yes. Okay, that's good. That's good stuff. It's good stuff. And then the uh, the slashers, by the way, if I didn't read the description. Um, doing holy damage and reset the attack cooldown on kills. So if they kill something, they'll go in, then they'll like attack something else. And if they kill that, then they just kind of go on a spree. Uh, let's get rid of the guns of God, get the purple one down. I'm going to sell you and play you. Still looking for high roller, or we're looking for the uh, garrison spawn rate. Why are we looking for high roller? Because high roller gives you better cards, and we'll stop seeing common cards, actually. We'll stop seeing these low tier 1 cards. Uh, it's a... Uh... It's unfortunate, you know, burning a lot of money re-rolling, but at some point we'll get like a, uh, let's see what our crit chance at 17, that's half of what we were at by the end of last time. Insurance. Unholy crit. Yeah, I'm crazy. High roller. <laughs> I do actually want an unholy MG, but not a green one. I want a high roller. Yes! That's what I'm talking about. That right there is what I am talking about. That's what we need. And the crit chance goes up, so then the Unholy Pulse Tower uh, cooldown goes down. And good things are happening. The cooldown on the cooldown goes up, you could say. And then uh, you can see if they're... 
you can see on the the slashers when they don't kill something on attack they just get like frozen in place and uh you know give me another cell give me two cells Hundred percent holy damage is pretty good, especially because we want some damage for gluttony and greed. Golden fist, we don't need to worry too much about uh Don't need to worry too much about golden fist during gluttony, especially. As much as I don't want to sell this. Gonna have to need my high roller out here as soon as possible. And, you know, later on we might get a variety or something. But for now, the reason Golden Fist isn't gonna matter as much on Gluttony is because Gluttony, there aren't as many enemies as normally would be spawning in, but there's a lot. Well, there. They have high health, basically. And then, you know what, finally. <laughs> Level that up, please. Recycle, yeah, sure. How many Unholy Christ do we have? Don't we have three? One, two, okay, yeah. So, green one, you're gone. Unnecessary. Variety for the hope of getting purple cards hellfire damage nope see the the first couple times I played greasy I focused a lot on just trying to do temptation 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 I was like yeah we'll just buy sell make a bunch of money no, you need luck because you need to get good cards. Sell, sell, plus 80, yeah. Oh, I shouldn't have done that because it doesn't account, it doesn't apply to both, but it is what it is. I think I lost like 20 gold on that. Yeah, I lost, no, I lost 40 gold. That's a lot, but you know. Lifespan, that is not spawn rate. I know we've got the crit chance down, so if we at least just get that, and we need unholy damage because we need some kind of damage, you know, if we at least just get crit rate for today, I'll be fine. Just crit chance is A-OK -okay with me. Would I like both? Sure. Do I need both? No. An unholy pulse tower is about to send out a pulse that's going to do like a lot of well, not a lot, but a fair bit of damage, you know? It's gonna do a little good... <laughs> it's gonna do a good little bit of damage there. Not looking for any of these. Dark Marker's a good 60 gold, I think. Yeah. And then you can just do some damage to everyone. Doesn't matter whether or not they die. Get some extra unholy damage. Gonna be honest, that pulse tower I don't think is meant for this world, so... Gotta go, you gotta go. I got a good three reshuffles sitting here, so... You know, just gotta hope we get what we're looking for. Looking for spawn rate for the task, and we are looking for... Luck for... Well, also kind of the task, because it makes the task easier, because the less white cards we see, the more likely we are to see a blue card. We're looking for a blue card that increases the spawn rate of garrisons by 10%. But... If we can't get high enough luck, then we're not likely to see it. A. And B, getting high luck also just increases the rarity of cards, so... Makes it more likely to see better cards. 
and then I can do replenish and sell. Twenty six percent, that's pretty good. Holy Pulse Tower or something special, isn't it? You know, I'm gonna be honest, you're not doing it. And then, there we go, that's a purple to sell, see? See, it, it goes to 65, but if I sell you and then I sell you, there we go. 85 instead of 65 if you sell them separately because they cheat you Well, they don't cheat you they consider the two cards as one whenever you go to sell them So instead of you getting plus 40 gold you get plus 20 gold And I should have played that before I sold them, but it is what it is You know last run last run we played this and it was all right It was okay But this run no Got big plans. Got man plans. <sighs> or not, I guess. If the man plan is to man plan is to not re-roll. The man plan is to get another high roller. So we're gonna have a shop coming up soon. As in soon I mean after greed. And greed comes after gluttony. And you know, uh, insurance makes this a lot easier because the last time I did this, it was without insurance. And let me tell you, it's not good. 50% gears and spawn rate, that's what we're looking for. Mm -hmm. More cycle, I've deemed you're not worth it. High roller jackpot. High roller. First gold, and it's not an unholy pulse tower. The ju well, it's getting me judgment like a lot. I mean, I'm talking about this run and last run, which is up. Right now, you should go watch it. It was a, uh... It's a good run. It was a garrison run. With, actually, Guns of God and Slasher, and it was... It went pretty good. Was it playing a streamer? Yeah, sure. But... Doesn't make it less good. This is a good round to get a purple Slasher. Mostly because it's a sell round. And we just got 90 gold, I think, so that's pretty good. 102. Okay, we don't need a third high roller. I know when enough... No, I know when we got enough high rollers. It's when we got two. Three is just too much. Unless we had, like, a charge up or something, but even then, no. Still want to do an active build. I haven't. Last run was like a pseudo garrison active unholy like build. Um. I know I've been looking for two high rollers, but it just seems a little obnoxious. So, 15% chance to get a tier five card. Yeah. Take insurance. Should have played insurance before I sold the other card, but it is what it is. And that, hey, our crit rate's taken off. Hang on. Hang on. Crit rate's starting to do something. 
And that's a good sell right there. I tell you what. It's a great sell. Great sell. You'll love to see it. Reshuffle. Reshuffle. I know we're looking for an only crit chance, but we're also looking for like a blue or purple one because a green one is getting a little bit energy inefficient. I'm gonna buy these strategically because I know when I sell it, A, I can sell it for more, but B, I need to. So no matter what, I can use it to draw one card. Okay. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. Open shop rift. Reshuffle. The like insurance makes greasy so easy, dude. This is like actually a breeze. This card, all cards in hand must draw for no. It is what it is. We are looking for blue or purple crit chance, which will be six and nine percent instead of three percent. I think there is purple one at least. Hope I'm not just making that up. And if I'm correct, golden fish should get some kills here. Yeah, it's nice to see. A little bit of change. And then, you know, variety. Yeah. It's pretty good. Increases all health, fire damage by 50%, decreases all other types of things. Ooh, he's gonna sell another gold. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And we do have that other, uh... We have the reload so we can play, sell, sell, play. I told you that that reload was tactical. Didn't just get that for... You know, jokes. I, I got that because I knew I was going to need it. So we go... Destroy you. Get you. Sell redemption for 110. Recover for. Play the unholy crit. Go open the shop rift. Look at the shop. Alright. Um. Praise be... Praise B is a very... Okay. Every single run that I have, I know... I j Praise B is like a, a, an all-around good. You can draw more cards to sell. You can draw more cards to combine. You can draw more cards to play. It's just... It's always going to be good. I don't think there's going to be a time where Praise B isn't good. I, I Like every single powerful run that I've had, I've always wished... Man, I wish I took at least one Praise B. Wait, does Fist of Gold, like, curse the enemies to drop 200 gold, even if they aren't killed by Fist of Gold in particular, or... We're looking for a blue card with a book that has an eye on it. I don't think we've seen it yet. That is the, uh... It's the garrison spawn rate. We already have a purple slasher. We need a gold slasher <laughs> it's funny that I can't buy it it's also a little messed up tower attack speed for sure 
because this thing's going to be dealing some serious damage. Uh, what is it? 35%. Okay, we got to start. Unfortunately, we got to start playing those like crazy. And let's sell you and you out of here. Lost some gold, but it's actually not okay because the rerolls cost so much now. Could I please get some, uh, you know. I actually don't know what I was talking about. Could I please get some unholy crit? Some blue unholy crit or something? Please. Pretty please. I beg of you. Um. Not too sure what I want to play here. You know, I'm gonna be honest, Jackpot. You might be going. Variety for sure. Okay, variety. Come on, man. Really? Giving me enlightenment? Could use some more unholy damage. We could all see use in temptation, but unholy damage is a bit more important. I'm sorry, we just gotta cut down the number of cards in the deck. And we gotta gotta get a blue or purple crit. We need it. I can't justify taking it just because it's a crit. I know we need him, but like, not that bad. The unholy pulse tower is doing work, though. I can tell you that much. sell one of these which one is going to be probably insurance I'm going to be honest no I can't I can't justify that what I can justify is taking like a reshuffle or not a reshuffle maybe but um like almost anything in order to get more in order to get more draws in order to siphon down to the uh, siphon down to the uh, unholy crit speaking of which replenish come on actually we can temptation and then replenish yeah it gives us something bad that's still 40 gold and then we're also going to sell Resurrect because I just don't feel like it's taking up a slot. We need it to not take up a slot. We need slots. We need to go through as many cards as possible. Preach structure and play a quality to copy. Nope. I'd love that, but I can't do it. And Holy Pulse Tower is doing good work. It's doing great work, fantastic work. But will it be enough? I mean, it gets almost a killing blow on everything, but this is anger we're talking about. And anger is not known for having the highest health units. I'm just going to say that. Just putting it out there. Okay, our luck has crossed the 50 threshold. Um, You can go. I think our luck naturally goes up through the circles. So, don't have to worry about that too much. 
Yeah, thanks. No thanks. Forty-seven percent. We play. Five more blue and holy crits were good. You and you for a good sell. Let's get a hundred percent garrison damage. Or structure slot. Structure slot will be there next time. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I think we get about seven. Sell. Before we sell. Insurance. Unsell. Don't sell them both at the same time. Just sell that one, then sell that one. Unholy crit. And reshuffle twice. Hope for. <sighs> Increases garrison lifespan though. Unholy crit. I'm not taking a green unholy crit, man. Stop trying to force feed me it. That's not worth it. We have almost 24-7 crits going. When I say almost, I mean... Well, like... <sighs> Not exactly almost. I don't... I took curse them all because I was winning on playing it, but now that I think about it, I'm just gonna sell it. On holy crit. And we play variety to get three draws. Play replenish to get one. Frankie fast, hands as much as I'd love to play it. We only have one tower, we're only planning on getting one more. And 75 is a whole lot more useful to us than just 20% attack speed and then holy sacrifice, yeah, sure, whatever. It's 45 gold, I mean. Oh, but then you drew me a card. Which I wasn't really happy about. Which I'm not really happy about, but... Can't do much about it now. Yeah. I'd take a golden gun to God. Still got the blue and holy crit, still got the praise B. 56, 62, 68, 74. Okay. Insurance, golden fist. 45, 45. And now we shuffle. Because we don't want like any of these or any of these. I'm telling you. My Sunder Run, I saw the book for spawn rate. I saw it. It was an item. It was a book. It was a blue book with an eye on it. Well, it was a red book, but inside a blue card. Tier 3 card with a eye on it. With a book on it. With an eye on it. Rainbow? Yeah. Good sell. Is that 75? Unholy crit. These are both cells right now. They're not. So that's why I won't be doing that. I'll just wait until next turn. Because I mean, it sucks to wait until the next turn, but you know, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. And if what you gotta do is wait, then you gotta wait. I don't know what comes after this. I think it's fraud. 
still not completely sure. Um, destroy this. Put this in there. Sell the fast rock. Look at one of three cards, and it's going to be saw blade, and then it's going to get sold for I don't know how much, like 120. Then we get to re-rolling. Come on. Not what I'm looking for. Not what I'm looking for. Not looking for any of this. Also not looking for any of this. Come on man, gold and holy MG, gold slasher, um, book with the eye on it, and holy crit, it's really all I'm looking for. You got one job. Hey. I'm going to be completely honest with you. I think insurance time has come. Well, maybe not insurance, but I know temptation's time has come for sure. And also get rid of that judgment too. That thing's worth too much money. And I think... Um, I don't remember where I put it though. Yeah, there it is. My computer is not propped up off the table, so that's probably why it's malfunctioning because it's overheating there we go all right reshuffle 128 come on bring me down to 68 nope bring me down to 68 come on duplicating shiv is good though i can't i can't argue with that Doesn't give me enough to buy it, so you're safe for today insurance. I'm telling you the next time you're toast. And yeah, you're French. French toast. French toast is it gets kinda gross sometimes. It's, it's like after a while I'm just like, I don't really want French toast anymore. Extra structure slot. Okay, so it is violence. I couldn't tell it was violence or fraud, but I just said fraud because I thought it was fraud. Burn through the deck. So. And. This should give us enough gold to buy the... Yeah, I'm sorry, Crit. Now I'm going to have to pass up on you. Should be able to play the next turn. I don't know if I had enough energy to play that. I would have played it before I bought the other one, but I guess I did know, so... The duplicating ship is going to be really good with our high, high, um, crit chance. Going to not sell those both at the same time. We'll sell them at different times, and then we're going to... Unholy crits have a 20% chance. Unholy critical hits have a 20% chance to create a knife that shoots in a random direction that deals 25% damage. Which isn't bad. And then we roll. And roll. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Take a tactical reload. You know what? I'm gonna be honest. 
I should have took salvage. It's the first time I've actually seen salvage. I thought, man, maybe I want that. Because usually salvage is just hot garbage. It's just straight trash. And I want nothing to do with it. But, you know, this time around it doesn't seem too bad. Variety. I know I said I wanted a holy MG, but like, Dark Marker, it'll, it'll work. You know, it'll deal damage. May only be doing 15, but on a crit, it's recharging the unholy pulse tower. Unholy crit, temptation, sell, sell, shop rift, uh, salvage, you know, I'd take it, I'd take a salvage. Um, salvage plus like hot potato is pretty good. Subordinates, there we go. That's what we've been looking for. That's what we've been looking for. Now all we gotta do is play that three times. Literally. I think. <laughs> I think. Subordinate, we've been looking for that this whole entire time. I'm so glad it finally showed up. Now here comes the impossible challenge. Okay, 74, all we've got to do is play on Holy Crit one more time, then we can sell it. We can sell the green one. Got subordinates and duplicating shiv. We have to play subordinates three times. I think. Let me see. It should it should just be three. I, I, if I remember correctly. Duplicating shiv. Insurance. I'm sorry, you gotta go. Reload. Just for the better replenish. And you know, getting a gold to sell is, it's worth it. And then did I, yep, played a second on holy shiv. Um, we did have summon last garrison run, and it was a, the last video was a one garrison run, by the way, I will mention that. I did win with garrisons. <laughs> Main reason I feel so confident right now doing this. Tell me I have, uh, so here is the thing, right? We can play slasher and then worry about do I really need it? Do I really need a gold slasher? Or do I need to worry about subordinates? No, I think there's gonna be three turns that I get to play subordinates. Cheap. I wanna keep every penny I can get. I also want to say there's going to be a time that I get to keep. That I get to play Slasher again, but I don't feel like I am. So now is the time. The time is now. And give me like a Golden Holy MG, maybe? Another, uh, Shiv? No? Alright. That's fine. That's fine. We've got it in the bag for now. Um, would love some more just unholy damage. It'd probably be good to get some more damage out there. So 
a good sell and a good sell. We got a rune to take after this. Mm hmm. Hang on. We are at 74. Gets old. Increases unholy damage, play variety. Oh, Divine Light, don't mind if I do. Nice gold to sell, and then I can play you. And still draw a card. Even if it is just a green, I don't care. I still get $50 from you. Reshuffle for 80 who cares? Does it hurt my wallet a little bit? Yeah. Yeah, it does. Should I care? No. No, I shouldn't. Slasher? I already got you. Alright. Um. Have I didn't have struggle for very long during my last run what I can tell you though is that it did not seem to do much during the time that I did have it although the the life oh I forgot last run I had like this stupid amount of life on um, span on my unit so they would all they were all going for a long time like they were all really just always out And they had like 140% movement speed or 130%. It was just enough for them to like basically run around the outer edge and make sure that nothing really got in. I mean, don't stop till you're numb. I'm not, I'm not gonna stop till I'm numb, I guess. Every time I do that. They're trying to cost me some gold. Nope. Mm, nope. Mm, nope. Mm, nope. Mm, no. honest we don't need another duplicating ship what we need is some damage <laughs> another duplicating ship would have been funny but I'd like to make sure I don't lose this run because I have had runs that looked like this before and then I got to the end and that very final level just took my win from under me. I was, I was defeated. It's like, wow, it's pretty sick. Disgusting even. Three duplicating shivs, I'd like four, but just because the shop is coming up, the shop is coming up with the rerolls are so expensive. What if I get a gold that I'm looking for? What a gold that I'm looking for other than duplicating Shiv? Living Shadow, maybe, but this tower doesn't really... This tower doesn't shoot projectiles, so... Yeah, I'd say the key to winning a Greasy Run... Reload. Mm. 
And I'm telling you. Uh, lock 72, yeah. The key is high luck and having enough cards unlocked. And we should, oh wait, we're already set on an holy crit chance. What we're not set on is garrison spawn rate. Oh my god, we have three times to play it in just this short amount of time. Oh, this is gonna be a bit rough. Uh oh. Okay, well that makes it a bit easier. <laughs> As it a bit easier, I mean we're selling that. I don't know. What did I do with me? Um. Selling Living Shadow is a little bit unexpected, I will admit. But we need to get 180% spawn rate, because I'm going to be pretty mad if we don't. Like, it's... If I have to take two praise B, I will. Subordinates. Praise B. I didn't mean to sell those two at the same time. I should have sold them at different times. I just lost a good bit of gold there. Subordinates, come on, man. I know the name of the card and I'm not dropping it. That's what I told myself last time, too, and then I've been calling it the eye book this whole time. Book with the eye on it. Subordinates, or praise be. Subordinates, or praise be. Come on, I need one of the two. Or salvage. Salvage would be pretty good. Well, salvage wouldn't be good exactly, but... You know, if you're gonna give me just golds to sell, I'll sell them. I'll play duplicating shiv. Yeah. Praise be. Maybe. Maybe a praise be. Alright. If we can play... If we can play it within these two rounds, then we should be able to play within these two rounds. And that's all that matters. Four, and then an extra two, so we should be able to, hopefully. Plus 60. Unholy damage. Temptation. Another 45. We could start making profit off of cards, but it's not exactly what we're looking to do. Buy that if I could play it. But I think that's going to throw off the whole rhythm of the thing. We're gonna have to skip cards and hope for good RNG. That's that's the only thing we can do. Unless, yeah, no. Gonna have to skip and hope for good RNG. Subordinates. And then praise be. Replenish. <laughs> Is there a quick sell? Quick banish. No. Alright. Alright, it all comes down to this. So unlock all comes down to the next few cards we get. Praise be maybe. Shop has been stubborn with these praise bees. With the praise be. I've also completely stopped looking for the Unholy MG too, I just realized that. I've been so tunnel visioned in on Praise B or uh, subordinates that... Yeah. Yeah. Here's the thing. If we use this...
that means we're gonna get a next turn and we just messed it up. If we don't use it, then... Yes! No! No, they can still... They can still take it from me. They can still take it from me. I'm doing it. I'm going crazy. Praise be. Praise be or two tactical reloads. Praise be, please. It all comes down to this. It all comes down to this little bit right here. For a second, I thought I wasn't recording. I was about to lose it. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't even care if I lose this run. I don't even care if I lose this run. I don't even care if I lose this run. We came all this way to get some tasks done, and we're doing them. And we're doing them. Give me a gold. Give me a Frankie. Give me an unholy MG even though it's green. Give me a rock star even though it's only one. Ah. Let's go. Let's go. Easy W's easy w's they're not getting past that unholy pulse tower they're not getting past the unholy pulse tower you can't outpost the unholy pulse the unholy pulse the only pulse let's go easy w easy w easy w bro hey i'm not sure if that's a high score or not i think 908's my high score but you know Cool. 4,000 credits. Oh my god. There we go. Achieve 180% garrison spawn rate. That's a, that's a gold card. Cool. 80% of holy crit chance. Oh, that's how you unlock the purple one. Alright, what's up with this? What's up with this card? Oh, what's up with this egg? I don't care what's up with the egg, actually. Um, that's that's all for today. I mean, like, you know, we we did it. We did it. We got a greasy run. Hopefully, this teaches you how to like when you're on greasy run. You can use this, take the cliff notes. You know, um, yeah. That's gonna be all for today. Thanks for watching. D big, big W's. Big, like gets that was great um i'll see you all in the next video